Hello and welcome to my channel. Please subscribe to my channel and turn notifications on so that you can get the notification about my new tutorials. So today we are going to look at SQL Server. So topic today which I am going to cover is how to convert SQL Server Evaluation version to standard or enterprise edition based on your license key um, before you start this video i just would like to mention over here uh, i'm going to use my key for this conversion but of course in your environment you would need your own key because uh, the key which i'm going to use is uh, dedicated to me and it's my procured version of the key so in order to activate or in order to convert your valuation version to um, the version like standard or enterprise you need the key for it before we begin just would like to show you um, if you go to properties over here here it is mentioned microsoft sql server enterprise evaluation 64 bit so now we would like to convert this installation to the standard or enterprise edition i'm going to convert into standard edition so for that what we need is we need to have sql uh, installation media and if you see over here i have my iso attached to it so what i'm going to do is i'm going to run the setup for this particular installer when i'll reach to this sql server installation window rather than going into any other place i am going in my maintenance and over here if you see i have addition upgrade so i'll click on this and over here if you see it shows me evaluation version developer version or express edition here i will have enter the product key so i am going to enter my product key over here which i am definitely going to blur so once we'll enter this key after that we'll click on next so i have entered my product key over here i'll click on next over here i have to of course read this license agreement and accept it and next over here later it will check for the prerequisites and here it will ask me if i have more than one instance installed on the same server it will give me option to choose that but in my case i am going to use this instance which is there and i'm going to click on next over here here also you can see it is stating that it is addition as evaluation so now what it will do it will try to upgrade this to the late um, standard version of the product so if you see over here it says sql 2019 edition downgrade if i look at the warning it says um, the destination edition may not support all the feature or capability as the current edition source evaluation edition and the target standard edition is a downgrade path be very careful on these kind of things if you are using a key which is downgrading it it might uh, break your databases so make sure you are using the correct key as per your edition then you will click next and then it will give me the summary kind of a ready to change the sql server edition and whatever features are there it, it will list over there whatever we have installed and then i'll click on upgrade and it will start the process of this upgrade which is converting my evaluation version into standard version this process may take some time based on the hardware resources based on what you have so you need to be little patience you need to be little patient on this part and wait for this process to get completed so if you see over here now it says information about the set of operation of possible next steps says database engine services sql browser sql writer and so on the thing is good we'll close this and let's see what is the status of our 
SQL Server now. Now, if I take properties over here, you can see that it states that SQL Server Standard 64 bit is installed over here and the operating system I'm running. Thank you so much for watching this walkthrough. Please use the comment section below to let me know if this solves your problem or this is what you are looking for. And to discuss more about any of the technologies which I'm talking about. Thank you and stay blessed.